And then the NBA All-Star Game is bringing big names to Chicago like LeBron James. There will also be a big demand for shirts, hats, and other merchandise. The I-Team found out what to do so you don't get fooled into buying a fake. It's a marquee event. Michael Potenza is the vice president and assistant general counsel of intellectual property at the NBA. He says fake hats and t-shirts are some of the most popular counterfeited items. The NBA shared pictures of a counterfeit Hornets jersey near a real one. And look at this. The NBA says these are pictures of more alleged NBA counterfeits. If you want to get real stuff, you should go to authorized retailers. Potenza says many times fakes are sold online or from street vendors, and you should beware for this weekend's All-Star Game. He also showed the I-Team official NBA hats and shirts for the All-Star Game. When in doubt, he says look for the NBA tag or hologram and make sure that that hologram is real too. So what should consumers look out for? And if you see at the bottom there's a hologram, you want to kind of move that around in the light, and you're going to see a very sharp, colorful um, basketball where you can see the, the, the details. What if a consumer says, hey, I'll just take the cheap fake one? For those people who think counterfeiting is a victimless crime, um, you know, it's really not. It hurts local businesses who are playing by the rules, who are paying taxes, who are hiring fellow Chicagoans. The NBA says real hats and t-shirts would go for $20 or way more and also usually have the Nike brand or the 47 brand attached. Now any $5 hat or an item that seems like it is too good of a deal is probably way too good to be right. true. It's probably too cheap. That's the biggest warning sign. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.